Hey, you people, happy Manic Minute Monday. As you may have noticed, the lighting here is a little weird. That's because I'm actually filming at midnight. <laughs> so this is the first ever Manic Minute after dark. Anyways, this week we're talking about geometry, labyrinths, and Aslan the freaking lion. Now here we go! First up is the artist and cabinet maker named Benjamin Nordsmark. And he just created the first ever playable labyrinth coffee table. How many good things can there be in one sentence? With magnets, you can move figures through a labyrinth coffee table. I hope D&D takes this concept and just runs with it, just... Do you imagine doing a campaign with figures moving by themselves? Benjamin, you're onto something. Next up is a creature painter named Hun Tunan. He's a brilliant style, it's sort of like splatter paint mixed with humanisticness. They look real and fake at the same time. I mean, look at this, it looks like Aslan the Lion. Uh, next is a music video by the artist Sun Lux. His latest song features pins and rubberized thread. Yes, apparently rubberized thread is a thing. You'll see what I mean in a couple seconds. If you click it, if you don't, you, you won't. And finally, there's a new art exhibition called The Key in the Hand. Why is it called The Key in the Hand? I have no idea. But it's really cool to look at. It's a series of strings and keys in a big room. And actually, all the keys were collected from thousands of different people all across the globe. Although now there's a lot of locked doors that have no keys to open them. Woo! We ended on a downer. Thanks for that, my guys. I really do appreciate it. Before you go, hey, make sure you like the video. Share this video. Mm -hmm. It's like day old water. <laughs> Share this video with your friends and subscribe. Thanks, guys. I'll see you next week on Monday. Now go inspire your souls. My truth or lie for you this week is I live on a farm, I have a pet fox, and his name is Jackson. Is it a truth? Is it a lie? Good luck!